Yes. Is this a recording? Hello guys, in this video I'm gonna in here by myself, it's a new Eve even and the guys want some time off so I'm just gonna put a few hours in. Today we're gonna build wall with a steel studs. This is 3 and 5 8, 25 gauge steel studs. This one here is the top track, you can see have uh, some slot on it. What we do here, we, once we screw the, we just screw the stud, we just put the screw in there. This one would allow the building to move and not damage the wall. So this is a way to go. And uh, here we have the bottom track, it was 3 and 5 eighths, everything is 3 and 5 eighths. We just put it on the floor, I will show you. Here we have the care channel, or stiffer. This I show you where it goes, like it just goes uh, between the stud. You see the steel stud has this hole right there and is where it goes so it gives stability to the walls. Go from there. What else we have in here? My pouch in there we have some fire stop. This fire stop would go where the drywall gonna meet the concrete. Top and bottom once we put the drywall. This is a few other stuff. We have some screws in here for the framing. We have shots for the gun. We have pins and we have this. Here is acoustic Cocking. We're just gonna use it to put on the track that way give some extra sound protection once we nail the track to the concrete or the stud we're just gonna use it. Very much uh, the tools that I'm gonna use is not a whole lot of tools. I'm just gonna use this guy, a small laser, this gun, the old timer to shoot, the pins, shock line and very much the hand tools, like I snip a few hand tools in here. And we go from there. This wall is a fire wall, so a divide wall. We need two hours fire rate, so we're just gonna do two layers of 5.8 on each side. And this is how it's gonna work. And I show you guys how we do that and then in between you just gonna use some rocks wall isolation safe and sound to make sure everything is good and try to eliminate some of the sound and we go from there and those here we're gonna be working on the floor just uh, cleaning up all this old stuff and make look good it's a bit to go but on this videos we go for the firewall that we're gonna work on and i'll be showing you some clip like i say i'm here by myself so Let's keep going, let's keep work, and see you guys very soon. Let's hang this wall up. Thank you. Yeah guys, uh, here I'm just gonna put some studs up. I have the bottom track and the top track down, so now I'm just gonna cut some studs, put them up, keep on going here. This stuff is very easy to cut. You need the nude, just with a thin slip, just cut it. Yeah, my friends, so I have this stud up, now I'm gonna put a few screws in, then I'm gonna put the stiffer or the carry channel on it, and we go from there. Most of the time when I can use a steel stud, I prefer to use the steel stud than wood, and uh, as you guys see, I just use a snipper to cut them, and no mat noise, no mat left over, like I have left over, gonna be just uh, not very heavy, just a... Uh, few kilos and uh, this is why I, whenever I can I prefer to use a steel stud than wood and they keep the wall straight forever right? okay let me put some screws and then I'm gonna show you guys put the stiff or the carry channel on it all right 
Let's rock and roll. Fuse one of this clumps to put the, to hold this two together for me to screw on. And I'm gonna space them 24 inches apart is what the print is asked for. And we go from there. Yeah guys, on this first start here, I'm just gonna level it because I don't know if the corner wall is uh, level so I can use this level or I could just use the laser to plumb it That one I know is good, right? I can, uh, else I could use the level to check it out So what I do is I, I level one of this and then I, I measure 24, 24 the center and just keep going once I pass the other column, I would level the first stud too because never know if the column is out of level or not. And then I just keep going with 24-24. Yes, my friend, this section here is up, so I'm gonna put the, what we call the stiff, the carrier channel. Let me put it on, and i show you guys how. Yes guys, just to show you, so the wall is coming up, I start this morning, is everything is up, I still gotta do a bit, I still gotta screw the top on the other section is in there, this is the stiffer to make the wall solid, doesn't move that way, still start is a little bit softer, so you see how it's flexible, but once you put the stiffer in, it works pretty good, I did that section in there, that way you guys could see it. On top track there, you can see the top track. We have the slot track in there, that way they allowed for the movement of the building. This one here gonna be a washroom for this unit, so it's already uh, framed on this side. This one is about uh, 12 feet high on this section, the rest is about 10. There you go, just to let you guys know, this is uh, a way is on the body, doesn't hurt the body as wood, and uh, easier to work with. Not a whole lot of noise, all right? And uh, is how we go. And then we have those uh, fire cold dry all to go up. What gonna happen in here, we put this wall up. We're gonna do this side, finish this side. The other side, we're gonna wait for inspection. When the inspection comes and says it's okay to go. And then we wrap up the other side. At this side here, they want to open it very soon. Other thing that what happened in here is, is another contractor that is doing the divide this, this side in here. So we just want to get it done. Our part that is the divide the wall and I uh, will just start here and let them work do whatever they want and then we're just gonna concentrate on on this other side to work on this side there gonna be a yoga place so if somebody like yoga it's a uh, time to do exercise and enjoy it what can I say my friends let me get this side here plugs out I gonna just gonna keep going here probably gonna take me another hour hour and a half to screw on the stud and put the care channel we go from there I just want to have the steel stud all up today and then we can carry on with the dry on very soon so put your thumbs up for this video and you are not subscribed yet subscribe for the channel and i just keep work to have more video coming up for entertainment and uh, you guys might learn one thing or two from it if you guys already know and have some suggestions i would like to hear from you guys let me keep going here hello my friend here's bayon this is my day december 31st just working here put some metal up my helpers they just wants to take off just go from there let's hang some dry out tomorrow maybe the next day or something like that 
and let's bang it up. Yeah guys, uh, like I say, wall is up and I just gotta keep going. Let's rock and roll. I just, uh, right now, I just about to call it the day, wrap up my tools and go from there. It is, uh, anyway, it is December 21st. I believe it's almost uh, 6 p.m. So it's time to go and see the kids and see what's up. This is how the day goes. Most of it is up, all the still start. I just have to put some, do some more care channel and other little stuff like that. But the big stuff is, is done, like you guys can see. Next step would be to hang the dryer, hang heavy stuff. Let's take from there. I had to take this one on because the guys just the guys that we had to work they just wants to have a little bit rest and they are right so I just have to step in and uh, do a little bit that way client be happy and we get some get us some activity get the bottom shape a little bit going up and down the scuff and all work good and life is wonderful okay let me wrap up in here and head home all right guys I love you guys, look on the channel, if you guys didn't subscribe yet, subscribe because we're gonna have a lot of good content coming up and uh, we go from there, right? Life is great, so thank you for watching this video and I love you guys.